Margarita here. Just wanted to pop in real quick to tell you about some snacks. Now, I just finished working out, and typically I'm very hungry after uh, after working out. I lift weights, and I do minimal cardio, but I do enough to work up an appetite, and I have a confession. My favorite food is potato chips. Yeah, salty and high in carbs. <laughs> However, my mother's a master herbalist, and she's always looking for ways to give me alternatives, healthy alternatives, to a lot of the quote-unquote bad foods that um, I like to eat. So a couple weeks ago, actually about three weeks ago, she gave me some products by this company called Husk Organics. And it's popcorn, but it's healthy popcorn. Uh, very low in sodium, but high in taste. And I have to agree that it is. They come in these interesting flavor combinations, like this one that I've been working on is spirulina and dragon fruit. She gave me a few, but I'll just show you all a couple here. Another one is matcha and coconut water. And these are very interesting combinations for popcorn. Um, but I'm very pleasantly surprised, actually. So I have not had potato chips since I've had these. So it's been a couple weeks since I've had potato chips. And I can admit that I have not been craving them because these have helped satisfy the craving without having as high of a sodium content as most chips. So for those of you who don't know, typically, I'm sorry, typically... Sodium is a bloater. Well, for me, it is. So it'll help you retain, not help, it makes <laughs> you retain water a lot of times. And I'm someone who carries my weight in my face. So typically, um, I look bigger than what I am because I have a fat face. I've always had one since I was little. Um, so if you carry your weight in areas that are not ideal, you definitely want to monitor your sodium intake because it can have an adverse effect on your appearance. So for me, someone who carries their weight in their face, the last thing I want is something that's going to bloat me more. So I am so happy I'm able to have my, my cravings fulfilled without uh, looking like a water balloon. <laughs> so I have to say that I'm very pleasantly surprised and pleased with Husk Organics. The products are organic, which is 100% fine by me. I love things that are as close to nature as possible. Um, your body likes it better that way too. The sodium content is very low. And it's even got a little bit of protein, three grams, but every little bit helps, especially when you're trying to put on some muscle. Um, they use Himalayan pink salt. So that's a, a better version of salt versus a lot of the table salts and iodized salts and different salts that are used in most uh, food, especially processed foods. And I have to thank my mom for that. Uh, she she did good. She did very, very well. But sometimes, you know, when someone is giving you a healthy, a healthy alternative, it's just like, I'll just take the risk and eat the bad food because at least it tastes like something. But I am very happy. So I recommend giving Husk Organics a try. Please note, this video is not sponsored. I just wanted to let y'all know about a good product in case there's someone like me who is looking for an alternative to potato chips. Um, it's, it's hard, <laughs> but I have to admit that these definitely help cure that salt craving a lot. And I haven't had any chips since I've been eating this popcorn. Not saying I'll never eat chips again, but I definitely have a level of self-control that I did not have before when it came to potato chips. Um, trying to think if there's anything else of note. Oh yeah, like, subscribe, comment. <laughs> Margarita La Muñeca is my channel and I'll be posting more things soon. Thank you.